Hey guys, it's Eric here, out here with uh, Tracer Electronics in Abbeville, South Carolina. After a pretty good rain day, got standing water for the upstate of South Carolina, home of red clay. And uh, I'm going to go over some of the data that I received. There is the cat path that I pushed the cart. I'm no longer hooked up to my cart. I'm hooked up to uh, my internet here at home. And uh, what I'm going to do is, I'll pick out my cable line. Uh, I know that this right here is my cable line, so I'm going to select my green my orange for my cable i'm going to simply put a dot on top of it right there as you can tell it puts a dot onto your map as well i'm going through here uh, there's another one right there that's my cable again i'm gonna put a dot on it as you can tell it puts a dot there to start with and there on google earth i'm gonna go on through here again here it is again right there come back through make sure i didn't miss it anymore maybe right there not that's gonna be my water line right there because you can tell it threw it off that's gonna be my water line so I'm gonna undo that mark and I'm gonna change it to my water my water right there I'll come back through this may be nope it's not it so right here I've just come back through I'm just reviewing my data that I've gotten um, at that point, it has thrown GPS maps onto my GPS plots on my map, as you can tell. Uh, my cable line that feeds my house back up to this side goes back down the side of my driveway to the road. At um, that point, I'm done. So let's say that we're done with it. We mash back. I'm going to generate a field summary report and a KMZ. Time I'm done. So at that point, I'm going to click on my PDF report. I'm going to say just once on here. And at that point, you get a field data report with everything. A disclaimer, um, the actual map you are looking at. And you also take your green path line off if you'd like. That way you just have the orange dots. And then right here, you have your longitude, your latitude, and the depths of all of them. Let's go back real quick to our GPS. This is a Samsung tablet we're working off of. Um, very high IP water testing. I mean, how many tablets would you do this with? And still is going to work fine. You can actually submerge a Samsung tablet in water and it will still work. And you can still zoom in on your hyperbola, zoom out, and also change your gain. But uh, this is Eric with Tracer. Just want to do a quick video to uh, show you the Impulse Radar. And if you've got any questions, please feel free to reach out. You'll have a blessed day.